where in Nakuru, the same issue, county MCAs are up in arms of a decision by Governor Lee Kinyunjui to appoint Lucy Kariuki as the county executive member for youth. The appointment comes days after the MCA still built an impeachment motion against her while she was wrote CEC. Good morning, Miriam. I hope now you can hear us and we can hear you. And we had asked you about um, this reappointment of uh, the CEC. Were they so much against this despite that uh, controversial impeachment? Well, some initially engineer Lucy Kariuki was the CEC for roads, but uh, as at yesterday, uh, she was reappointed to the position of uh, youths and uh, sports as the CEC for youths and sports. Now we understand that 15 days ago, a, a tribunal, a five-member tribunal was formed to seek ways that, uh, or rather to give ways as to how uh, the CEC will be impeached on grounds or of alleged uh, uh, issues of uh, integrity while in the office as well as in incompetence rather so those are some of the issues that stemmed up forming that uh, five-member tribunal 15 days ago and uh, last week on Friday uh, there was bring discontent among uh, the MCAs some saying that uh, they need the CEC to be impeached that is engineer Lucy Karaoke and then uh, others were not for it uh, again uh, this uh, coming up as a result of uh, yesterday uh, the through the director of uh, communications Beatrice Obocha uh, uh, Governor Lee Kinyanjui reappointed the CEC uh, engineer Lucy Karaoke to the sports docket, a uh, youth and sports docket, again, uh, making the deputy governor acting uh, CEC for roads. But joining me here to shed more light about this issue is uh, the MCA Menengai Ward by the name Wilson Wajef, who will just tell us more about where this issue came up from. Uh, maybe ukianza tu tena kwa kujitambulisha utombie, shida ilianza lini na CEC engineer Karaoke na shida gani haso? Uh, kwa kifupi na tunaweza sema ya kwamba bunge letu la county ya Nakuru tumekuwa na shida sana na wajumbe ambao wameweza kuteuliwa na wamekuwa na shida sana katika upande wa barabara tukikumbuka ya kwamba kuna zile uh, mambo ambayo tulitenga ya boresha barabara ambao ni jambo la maana sana ambalo tulikuwa tumejihusisha ya kwamba itatengeneza mambo ya barabara zetu lakini imefika ya kwamba waziri wetu ambaye ni CEC Rusi uh, inasemekana ya kwamba katika hiyo mambo ya boresha barabara imerudi ikakuwa ni mambo ya kuharibu fedha za kaunti hii ya Nakuru na hili jambo ambalo tulikuwa tumedileta tulikuwa tumeona litasaidia wananchi sana mambo ya barabara lakini kwa fikia sasa tumeona ya kwamba wajumbe wengi wamekuwa kilia sana wakisema ya kwamba hiyo mipango yote imezoroteka na ikakuwa ya kwamba wajumbe wanapigwa sana machinani na wananchi wakisemekana ya kwamba boresha barabara haikuwa ya kuboresha ilikuwa ya kuharibu mali ya umma haswa wakati tunaangalia kama katika mji huu wa Nakuru tumekuwa na shida sana na mambo ya street lights uh, kwingi kumekuwa ni mambo ya giza na wakati tunakuja kuuliza sababu ya waziri wetu asije akafanya hii mipango ya kuhakikisha ya kwamba mambo ya street lighting and uh, the boresha akasemekana anakuwa very rude anaanza kuogresha wajumbe katika lugha ambayo si si nzuri na wakati maswali inaulizwa wakati anarikwa katika kamati za bunge za barabara hakuji tukaonelea ni vyema sasa angatuke katika hicho kiti na kwa sasa tulileta huyo mswada katika bunge wiki iliyopita na haswa tukaonelea kwamba kuna pahari ama mpango ulikuwa umepangwa wajumbe ambao walikuwa wengi wakati walisema wafanye baroting wengine wakasema hata hawatafanya secret ballot wale wengi ambao walikuwa nataka uchindi wakasema tufanye uh, mlolongo na dipo uh, speaker wetu akasema haitawezekana na siku ya leo tumerudi na tumesema ya kwamba huyo mswanda tunataka kurudisha na vile vile watu uh, wajumbe walisema ni ya kwamba lazima Lucy angatuke katika kiti cha roads na labda uh, kwa sasa tumeona kwamba uh, uh, governor Lee Kinyanjui ameweza kumteua tena kama uh, CEC wa uh, youth unadhani vipi haswa nini kinaweza kuwa kimebadilika uh, hata kama amebadilishwa kwa sasa hatujui kama hizo barua zimefika lakini haswa sisi kama wajumbe 
tutahakikisha kwamba kwa vile huo mswada ulikuwa kwa uh, kwa slot paper lazima tutauendeleza saa hizi hizi tunapotapoongea tunaingia katika kikao na lazima tutafanya uh, uchaguzi ambao lazima tutahakikisha ya kwamba tumemngatua kwa vile wajumbe wameamua vile Sali so, la mwisho kwako ni wawakilishi wa wadi wangapi ambao wanapinga hii hatua ya uh, Kariuki kuendelea Wale ambao wanaunga mkono Lucy angatuke ni hamsini na moja. Kwa hivyo tuko wengi almost three quarters. So tuna hakika ya kwamba huu mswanda ukiletwa lazima utapita. Lazima utapita kwa vile wale ambao ni wachache ambao wanaunga mkono they are very few na itajidhirisha kwa vile wakati huu within the few minutes tukifungua the new shapers tunaingia katika huo mswada Well there you have it Sam and uh, Zinzi that is uh, the Menengai ward uh, uh, MCA uh, Wilson or Jeff shedding more light about the issues saying that uh, one of the issues that they really need uh, the CEC uh, for uh, uh, currently the youth CEC engineer Lucy Karioki is that uh, the fact that she is uh, not really uh, Uh, the, the integrity issues that she is facing right now is what is posing uh, that question as to if she is competent to be in uh, that uh, position. But uh, we understand again is that uh, over 51 MCAs are for the idea to have uh, the CEC impeached. Uh, we will keep an eye here and uh, give our viewers real-time updates as to what happens uh, at the Nakuru County Assembly. Back to you, Zinzi and Sam. All right. Thank you so much. Of course, uh, stick there for us. And, you know, subsequent bulletins. Been